All right, here we go. We're gonna do. We're going to assemble the monkey bars. So uh, yeah, Autodesk Inventor. I'm gonna make sure I have all my stuff downloaded from my drive into a folder that I can access. All right, new assembly or new uh, assembly. There we go. Okay, we're gonna play stuff. Now I put a folder called monkey bars. That's a playground. I'll take the monkey pole. Uh, let's see. I'm just gonna put one of them in for now. Um, place. Now let's see monkey bars. Here, this one I should have two. Let's see. That was the monkey bar. That's the top of the monkey bars. Will actually be. Um, see ruts upright monkey bar this we're gonna have two now this is going to excuse me that's that's gonna be the the legs for the side that the kids would be able to climb up and go over and here this one's just gonna be a ladder so uh, all right now that I placed everything we press escape and we got it now Let's start by putting these big bars together. Uh, these and these are lined up pretty well, but we gotta put these down. So I'm gonna constrain. Woohoo! I'm going to connect the bottom of this to the top of that. Okay. Get a little pop noise. Now let's see. I apply it. And now I want to go from this one to the other one, so looking good. Now, let's see. Now, here is the one that we, I'm working with. Now, you can see that they are attached in one direction. We still need to attach in two others. So, let's see. I know I want... be very careful here you want to make sure that the holes are going in the same direction with all of them so let's do a flush ready watch this so I want this to be flush with this good apply and I want this to be flush with this as well now that I've done that, let's see what it looks like. Yep. Now we just have to stop it from sliding back and forth. And so we really probably could do it with just one. So flush. Oh, no. Flush. <laughs> looks good to me. Now just this one. Excellent. There we have it. Now, if everything is the right size, it should all fit really well. Uh, no problems. Now, another trick, if you copy this, you can paste it. And then you have two of the same thing. It saves you a lot of time. Uh, to copy it, it's you click, you hold shift now, and then you click the extra pieces. Hold Control press C, hold Control press V, and it appears around your mouse. Looks good. All right. Now. We have our two monkey bars. Here we go. And now we've got these poles that we got to deal with. Now, let's see. Next step is getting this pole into all the holes. All right, so to do this, the first thing we're going to do is just take this peg. Okay, let's, let's make three of them. Okay, I just copied it, pasted it two more times. And we're just going to get one of each peg in the holes for each side. So um, start off, uh, let's see, here, insert. Okay, now it's going to ask if you want them to like, or aligned. 
uh, start off, align it, get it in there, and make sure that it's going in the correct direction. I mean, I guess the first one doesn't really matter. It's going to go in anyway, so just say apply, and you're going to do the same thing with the other ones. Okay, and now, let's see, I got the two sides, now let's get this one put in there. Great. So now we are going to do the same thing. Let's see. This should go in this hole. That doesn't look right. Cancel that. Strain, hole. Now this. Try it right in there. There you go. Looking good. Looking good. So the thing to be careful of, you want to make sure that you have the arrows pointing in the same direction. Ready? Look at this. So here, arrow is pointing to the left. Good. Now I want pointing to the left because that means that it's going to go all the way in there. Alright? Now that I've done that, I've got pegs in every single hole. Now let's see. Pattern. Feature. Right, so select that. Let's see. Column. Same thing here. Nope. Go down. Uh, I believe, let's see, we have six. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Put six in there. And let's see, I think it was ten inches. Yep. Okay. So we'll do that again. Click the thing that you want to... It's very, it's very similar to what we were doing before with the points. You click the feature, you say pattern... Okay, you click the rectangular one. Okay, so now we pick a direction. So let's we pick this edge. All right, it's, it's not going the right way, so we flip it. We count how many holes. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it will repeat six times. And I want to say ten, not a hundred, ten. Ten inches. That's wrong. So let's try 12. Hmm. That's it. That was wrong. It should be 7. Cool. Okay. Last one. And then we call it a day. <sighs> Click. Pattern. That. This thing. Click. Make sure the arrow is going the right way. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight at ten inches. Boom. Ah, that's so beautiful. Now, when you save it, make sure that you save it in the the folder. Like you gotta download the whole folder, you upload the whole folder. Otherwise it will not work. So I go. Playground. Monkey boss. And call it mo finished monkey bar assembly. Done. Look at that. Eight and a half minutes. Now just make sure you save this in your drive so you have it for later.